When looking at surgeries and some of the things that can help with recovery, hyperbaric oxygen therapy seems to come up a lot. And it can vary from something that is marketed as hyperbaric oxygen therapy that you slather on your face to full-fledged oxygen tanks or chambers that people sit in in order to increase the amount of oxygen in their blood. In honesty, doing one treatment to help speed up recovery right after surgery is not really going to benefit you in the long run, and it doesn't come without its risks. So you want to make sure that whoever is recommending it is certified in hyperbaric oxygen therapy, that the chamber or device that is being used is certified and has proven to be safe for use, and it's only really for specific types of situations and patients. Most commonly I see it used in hospital settings for patients who are burn victims, who have extensive wounds, for those that are paralyzed and have chronic pressure ulcers that are having a hard time healing. For the average healthy person that's undergone a cosmetic procedure, hyperbaric oxygen therapy is not necessary. Oftentimes it's used as more of a marketing ploy.